Hi. You may remember me from... Damn it. Hi. You may remember... Crap. Hi. You may remember me from such films as... Oh, come on, I'm recording in here! Hi. You may remember me from such videos as Life on the Road, Driven, and Asphalt Reptile. I'm Matt, your host for this evening. I'm here to share some exciting news with you. This is the end of an era and the beginning of a new one. It is both the Omega and the Alpha. Kind of like a supernova imploding on itself, destroying everything in its path and then creating new life. Here is my story. Hey guys, it's Matt again. And on YouTube, probably for the last time, and I mean it this time, so what have I been doing for the past, I don't know, six months, year, however long it's been? It's been a hell of a ride. Um, I'm officially now done with truck driving. I am out of the industry as of six months ago, actually. Um, I went from driving trucks to now working on trucks. That's right. Your boy is a diesel mechanic. And when I say diesel mechanic, I mean I am an apprentice diesel mechanic, basically. I'm learning. Uh, I did a little bit of schooling and I'm getting some hands-on uh, opportunities to work on these trucks. It's been a hell of a ride. It really has. Uh, I got to the point where I started thinking, would it be so bad if I rear-ended this person that cut me off and sent them sliding into the barrier? with not enough force to do any harm to them but completely destroy their car somehow it really started to tax me and i'd had enough uh i was away from my wife who we are pretty much were newlyweds kind of back then we'd only been married a year and there were times when she'd call me and i was in montana and say hey i'm having car problems i need help uh i can't help you call caa Number one, as a husband, that makes me feel awful. But number two, as a man, that, that never felt good, that I couldn't do anything for her. I wasn't there for special occasions. I wasn't there because I was always out and about working, and it finally started to get to me. I figure there's two types of truck drivers in this world. There's the men and the relationships that succeed in truck driving. The husband's away and the wife and husband prefer that and then they come home and they're closer that way or the other option is it leads to divorce i've seen too many stories of guys marriages falling apart because they're gone for so long and i didn't want to be one of those statistics i still enjoy driving trucks but really the only part of the trucks that i did enjoy driving was the shifting and the backing that's about it. Uh, tight turns as well. I enjoyed too. Uh, it just, I needed something new. I'd been doing it about 10 years. I'd racked up, I figured about 1.3, 1.4 million miles. I'd done everything. Well, not done everything, but I'd, I'd done lots of things and I'd seen pretty much the whole country and uh, it was time. I wanted something new. Um, I didn't or couldn't really go back to school. And so I figured, well, let me let me look into, you know, maybe mechanicking. Pretty sure that's a word, mechanicking. I'm going to Google that real quick. It's not a word. It's not a word. Anyways, uh, so this opportunity arose for me. And uh, I took it right away. I took it. And uh, it's been great. And I'm loving every minute of it. Having a great time and learning three, four things every day. And uh, it's been real healthy for me, for my relationship with my wife, and uh, just uh, my overall well-being. Um, I gained a bit of weight uh, driving truck again, and then I lost it because I'm a mechanicing now. Damn, word against. Anyways, guys, um, I'd said in the past many times, so I've been gone so long making videos or not making videos, but I'm back this time. And I did that two or three times. And every time I'd say, oh, no, no, this is for real this time. It's, I'm making videos for real. And it never happened. And the reason is I didn't have a passion for driving trucks anymore. I didn't care. Uh, when I first started making videos, everything was so exciting to me, so new. And I just, I wanted to share all this stuff with you guys and, and help new guys learn. 
And I think I, I reached that point of, well, I think I've helped as much as I can help somebody uh, with these videos. Now it's just about keeping content up. There was no creativity in anything I was doing. I was getting bored with making the videos and truck driving in itself. And that led to stagnation. So what am I doing now? Why am I making this video? You might be asking. And if you aren't asking and you don't care, then cool. I'm good with that too. But um, I'm home full time now. And uh, I decided to start a little Twitch stream. That's right, ladies and gentlemen. Your boy Matt loves video games. And I have since I was seven years old. And I'm 35. A grown ass man loving video games. But the number one person I have to thank for this is my wife. She's an understanding person. And uh, she lets me do this stuff and is very supportive in all of this. Uh, she allows me the time to do that and takes care of the dogs and the family. Well, the dogs and the family being me and her. Basically, I'm fed. I'm a man baby who can't look after myself sometimes, mostly with food. Can do laundry, though, and work on vehicles. But I have her to thank for this. So I've started streaming my gameplay on Twitch. It's a lot of fun. That's why I'm doing it. Um, I play with a couple of buddies of mine sometimes, sometimes I'm alone. Um, I'm just kind of starting out and, uh, it's been great so far. Um, and I just, I guess wanted to reach out to some of you and kind of let you know what I'm up to. Um, this video is a, Hey, come hang out with me on Twitch, twitch.tv slash the link sign. Mm. Um, come hang out with me on Twitch. Um, if not, that's fine. This is a, a last hurrah, I suppose. My memento mori, my farewell. Um, thank you for the eight, nine years, whatever it was of making videos and, and being there for me and supporting me and uh, shitting on me, telling me I'm no good, I'm trash, this guy needs to hang his keys up, etc., etc. Enjoyed them all. It's great stuff. It's really entertaining. I take the good with the bad. Doesn't hurt my feelings. But for those of you who really supported me and you know who you are, um, thank you. It's over now. Uh, there won't be any more 1776 films or videos, but I'm continuing on, um, I guess my online career persona on Twitch. Um, I'm still the same guy on Twitch. I swear a little bit more and say much ruder, vile jokes, but for the most part, it's good natured and good humored. So I don't know how else to thank everybody for watching all those years and always supporting. How do you thank somebody you don't know that lives in a different country for, for being there and, and supporting everything you did? I, I don't know what to say. Just know that those of you that were there, I, I do really appreciate it. And it was a, a great time in my life that I'll never forget. And it's always going to stick with me. So on to newer, bigger, better things, I hope and more fun things. It was fun in the beginning making YouTube videos and then it died off. And now what I'm doing is fun again. So come hang out, stop by, say hello, whatever you need to do, twitch.tv slash loing sign. What is loing sign you may ask? Last note, loing sign is a shitty translation from Gaelic to Irish of the last name Lynch. It's actually, oh loing sign, I spelt it incorrectly one time and it kind of stuck. To everybody who stayed with me, good night.